We read the book yesterday, Earth Day, Every Day, and I hope you guys enjoyed listening to that. And today we're going to go on a little adventure where you're going to find some things on a list that's been linked for you into your Edsby account. So, but before that, I'm going to show you some pictures of my nature hunt that I went on um, so I could give you guys examples of what you're going to do. I want you to load as many pictures as you can and send them to your teachers or a little video, whatever you want to do. Um, and I look forward to seeing your pictures. I'm going to show you mine now. Okay, so guys, the first thing on our list was the dirt and then the leaf. Then I took a picture of some pretty uh, marigolds in my yard. And then this is a picture of some daylilies. Now we're moving to the spider, the creepy, creepy spider, but part of nature. And I want you to pay close attention to the butterfly and listen to the sounds of nature. Now we're moving on to the mushroom and the worm. Watching the video of the worm, really cool. All I had to do was dig in a moist area and it came up. The next picture is a picture of a bird, is a cardinal. Now there's an ant wanted the video of the ant because ants are really small and they're hard to take pictures of sometimes because they don't stay still. And now here's a bee. This is in my yellow jasmine. Now watch the squirrel. Really cool. We were having a little steering contest. Now we're moving on to the sprout. This is a little plant coming up in my pot. And the trees, we have a big oak tree in my yard. And look at the pretty clouds. We had a pretty day today. And now here's the grass. That was the end of my nature walk. Now I want you to take a nature walk. Download the paper on your Edsby account. Your teachers have linked it. Then you can go through and you can color your page as you find the um, different areas on here. We've got our dirt, leaf, flower, spider, butterfly, mushroom, worm, bird, ant, bee, squirrel, sprout, tree, cloud, and grass. I hope you guys have fun finding them. I hope you find as many as I did. Um, if you don't, it's okay. Sometimes it's hard to find worms in different places or you may be somewhere where you can't find a bee and you need to always be safe. So have fun with your nature walk and um, I look forward to seeing your pictures.